want a breakfast looks good. A poached egg. <laughs> and I've got that. I did it. And I managed to book us into a campsite tonight. So. That was my first part of breakfast. <laughs> Yeah, really enjoyed it actually. Sausages yeah. were gorgeous. Cool. My poached eggs were probably the best poached eggs I've had for ages. So yes, they were absolutely lovely. On to the coffee. So breakfast is done and we are now going to load the bikes back up and we're off to see Percy Cross. No, <laughs> maybe not. East to the coast. Yeah, from Corbridge through Northumberland to Ornwick. Ornwick? Yeah. There's a castle there? Yeah. Ornwick Castle? Ornwick Castle, see, yeah. I know that. Yeah. How do I know it? I don't know. Stand it back. <laughs> absolutely boiling and uh, I've just finished all the packing so we're uh, getting ready to go on the uh, next part of the adventure still homeless <laughs> a couple of hobos still but um yeah home is where you ride it I guess and uh, I don't know where Neil's gone look oh he'll be sitting on his throne as always last poo of the morning but anyway, he always brings me to the best places. So, uh, yeah, look at the carpet. Look at the bed. Ooh. Best of all, though. Look at that wall. it hot. Yeah. 
Evidently, this became a Norman stronghold when a guy called Robert with the beard founded this area and built it up. He built the Martin Bailey Castle in around 1080 AD. Well, we didn't manage to stop where we wanted to stop. We carried on going straight through because we couldn't find anywhere to park. So uh, we carried on going and we've ended up here because we went about another 10 miles before we could stop. Lord, couldn't you have given him one more chance? Bewildered Mary was part of the congregation too. Reverend Jack, I didn't expect revelation to come so soon. Let's use that to enhance our message while we're pushing through. While we're pushing through. To the campsite um, just to put you up just a quickie for tonight I thought we'd get here a little bit earlier than usual but we do need to eat because we haven't eaten since this morning by the time we put the tent up we'll be starving I know we will Mailers There's supposed to be uh, some great coastal stuff here, okay. just over across the way. Like the coast and that's supposed to be really cool. Oh, yeah. Wow, the hair's a bit wild. But when you turn up to the campsite and uh, everybody else is pitched and they're all cooking and you're starving hungry and you haven't brought any food with you. So you've just got to, uh, you got to roll with it. So in the time that I have 
taken all of my straps off of my luggage on the back of my bike. Neil has started the tent. Look, there he is. Well, we're getting so much better at getting so much better putting up the tent, aren't we, Liz? Oh, yeah, hey? yeah. So we just found this little campsite. Look at this. And uh, we're going over because there's a little bar. I'm going to go and have a beer. I'm go oh, I've got to go to the toilet as well. I haven't been in there. The tent's over there, look. See, we're off season now. It's, it's the end of the UK season. So, school's gone back. And yeah, got pods, look. Yeah. But, I like this little outdoor area here. Yeah, look at that old van there. Lizzie's got dinner. That's and it. the entertainment. Look at the sky. We've got dinner and entertainment. Ooh, beautiful up here. Absolutely beautiful in Northumberland. Isn't it, Liz? Yeah, I think I might um, live here forever on my bike in the tent. Oh, One day we nice. might. Look at that, look tiny home, that'd be right. One day we might find a place to actually live in. Oh, gosh, that sounds blind. Oh. <laughs> wow. The sun came out this evening or this afternoon and it was beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Look at the sky man, you're gonna oh wow you wanna see this. You're on the camera. Go the bushes. Right look. I'm filming the sunset. Can't do that. I'm filming the sunset. Come back. I'm going over there, Liz, alright? 